I mean, come on, man. You can't say the school system's fair. Like, I'm not even just saying that for myself, you know? It's like, kids with special needs and kids who need to take Adderall to sit still. Like, are you telling me they get equal treatment? It's just not fair for anyone. I don't know. What do you suggest they do? I don't know. Let them learn about something they want to learn about. I'm sure they have more aspirations for life than that. Remember that kid, Max, from camp? He couldn't look anyone in the eyes, but... He stimulated my brain more than any teacher ever has. He stimulated you real good, didn't he? Shut up. But no, seriously. But no, seriously. What's the point in dropping out in the final semester? Just finish it out. I mean, it's just not going to help me with what I want to do in life. It's going to be another semester wasted that I could spend chasing my dreams. Yeah, because dropping out with the ten is a great goal, isn't it? I mean, I want to be a writer, but, you know, it's more about just doing what I want to do in life, you know? It's not really about just writing. It's like you go to school and write, but now I can eat when I want, I can do what I want. It's just it's freedom, you know? So then why is it that I'm sleeping a day of school here at the beach just listening to you talk about how you want to live in a tent? I mean, you're going to think I'm crazy, but, uh, I'm leaving today, and I just thought it'd be great if you uh, wanted to go with me, because you're pretty much the only person that would care that I'm I'm gone. You know, sincerely, I, I am touched that you would want me to go with you, but I can't I can't just drop everything. I have a family. I have a, I have a future. I can't just drop everything and go and live in a tent with you. So, what about your family? family doesn't care that I'm going. I mean, they don't care about my dreams. They just want to make sure I'm another number in the school system. They don't care about anything I want to do. Made me get a job. I hated it. The only real person that cares that I'm going is you, which is why I brought you out here. So, so I guess it's going to be it for a while at least. trying to get some work done. I'm just doing my taxes. Kill Bill, those are taxes. I don't need to be so bitter. You're the one out here with all the camping gear. Don't you have a job to do or something? Look, man, I'm just worried about my customers, man. Look here, fam. 
between you and me, I can get you a job if you need. I don't need a job. I'm doing my work right now. Living out in the woods? No I can get you some protection if you need. I'll hook you up with a gun. your help. I'm just going camping. I'm not homeless, so I think I'll be taking my business somewhere else. I was just trying to help, man. I know the struggle. I know who you are. Who are you? I did nothing wrong. You have the right to remain silent. Are you a cop? Anything that you say will and can be used against you in the I, court of law. I did nothing wrong, please. Yeah, you know what, get up, get up. What? You know what this is? Yeah, yeah, I just found it. I, I, I found it in the woods, it was discarded, I thought I could Use some protection. I'm sorry. You could get 10 years for this. I'm sorry. Put the pot down. Where's the magazine for this? Uh, uh when I found it, there, uh, there wasn't one in it. <laughs> Give me this chair. All right, sit down. Okay. Now, you're going to have to be 100% honest with me. All right, but I can't if we're freaking out right here, so why don't you just put the gun down, all right, and I'll tell you what happened. So, I got fed up with school, uh, nothing was really going my way, so I decided just to come out here and pursue my career choice. And uh, I just wanted to be a writer, come out here for maximum concentration, I did nothing illegal. So, are you staying out here or are you living out here? There's nothing illegal about staying in a tent. See. The problem with that is, I'm out here chasing a convict who escaped to the woods. How am I supposed to know that isn't you? How do I know it isn't you? See, I'm undercover, obviously. Um, this gun that you so happen to find is the gun that I lost in the woods. So again, prove to me that you're not the convict that escaped to the woods. Prove to me that you're a cop. You haven't shown me any hard evidence yet. Yes, we need backup at the Macintosh Woods. I repeat, backup at the Macintosh Woods. We have a 1098, an escaped convict. We have no sight of him, but we are closing in. Over. Anyone can just download an app. Well, I guess we have ourselves a predicament. I guess we do. Don't you have a family to get back to? Hey. Hello. I'm here. Sorry. Um, I mean, I do have a family, but if they cared about what I wanted to do, and they didn't just want to put me through school just to say that I did it, then I'd be home with them right now. <laughs> you know I risk my life every night to make sure you could stay at home. Nice little family like yours. Crappy families. 
Okay, here's the situation. There are cops all around us, all around these woods. All it takes is one call from my cell phone and they are swarming in here. Okay, 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 okay. You're stressing me out, you're stressing me out. We can't do this, we're freaking out. We're gonna have to act like adults here. We're both adults, so slow down. I'm sure you have a family you wanna get home to. Do you? Yes, in fact I do, and I have to do this job to make sure that they have food on the table. Uh-huh, uh-huh, okay. So if you wanna feed your family, why don't we just let bygones be bygones, you just pretend you didn't see me, because if I go with you, how do I know you're not the escape convict, you know? It seems kind of fishy, because that report said there was a convict, so obviously you didn't lie about that, but you don't have a badge, you don't have a gun, you don't have a uniform, so um, why don't we just let bygones be bygones? <laughs> That's not how this works! That's not how this works. I'm an officer of the law, right? whether you believe it or not. Either you're coming in with me, by your choice, or I drag you out of here. You are the murderer, aren't you? If I was the murderer, I would have shot you by Oh now. yeah? You have wasted enough time. Make your choice now. Now. All right, I made my choice. But no. No. No one's taking my freedom. You, you don't have to do this.